What's going on guys, Angel here. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna to be doing a little follow-up video for a company called Fifine. So in a previous video that I did for them, it was for a lavalier microphone actually. It was very affordable, it sounded great. The only problem was that the headset that they sent me had broken. So they actually reached back out to me, they sent me another one, and I'm here to do an actual live little unboxing again, uh, just to make sure that this one's working. Let's go ahead and go right into it. Okay guys, let's go ahead and check it out. Let's see what the inside looks like. All right, so same like, it's basically the same packaging and the model number for this one is the C1 uh, headset and lavalier lapel microphone. So if you were wondering from the last video, this is what it's called. But yeah, the same packaging again, really nice. I still like the small soft shell case that they give out. I like the little bag here. And uh, we'll go ahead and check the headset now. Go ahead and set this aside really quick. All right, let's see here. This time I'll make sure I do it slow too, just in case. It's a little bit hard to get out this time, but I'll take my time to make sure. Okay guys, so it was pretty tangled in there. I didn't want to mess anything up while I was recording and trying to look at me unboxing it. So I set it up once again. This is the lavalier microphone as you see here. And then on top of that, you have the splitter cable over there. So you can use two different types of uh, audio waves coming through. I'm going to test that in this video to be sure everything's working. And that's the headset microphone over here as you're seeing. And uh, we'll definitely check that out. There's nothing broken on that, I made sure. And then also you're gonna have the extension cable for your DSLR, or you can just use this as a regular extension cable. These are all ready for TRRS cables. So you can put these straight into your smartphone. And then you have another separate uh, extension cord over there. I'm gonna go ahead and get set up and put this uh, headset microphone on and I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. All right guys, so you're currently listening to the audio from my Rode Video Micro microphone. I have that plugged into my cell phone right now, which is a Galaxy S9 Plus. We're going to go ahead and switch over to the headset microphone in three, two, one. Alrighty, guys. So you're currently hearing audio from the Fifine headset microphone, as you all see here. This is a really regular tone. Uh, right now, I'm talking about as normal as possible. I know my voice is a little bit deeper. Let me know what you guys think of the sound in the comment section below right now. I'm really curious to hear what you guys think. I'm going to listen to it in post and uh, see the difference and whatnot. Obviously, this one probably sounds a little bit better just because it's closer to my face. Uh, I'm going to move around just a little bit more, move away from the camera move over here now i will say the extension cord i probably will use that because for this headset one uh, it is four feet but right now i'm about four feet away from my camera in terms of like range though i will say it is a plus because you already get four feet and then the extension cord is probably like another four to five feet as well i'll go ahead and move this around a little bit over here how does it sound now does it sound different move it back right here what do you guys think? Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below now. I'm gonna switch to the lab microphone now, and then we'll go ahead and compare those two. And after that, we will use the uh, splitter cable and try them out both at the same time. Alrighty guys, so I'm now using the lavalier lapel microphone from Five Fine. Let me know what you guys think on this one. I did listen to the audio just now uh, from the headset one, and I will say I heard some static, and I don't know if that's because my Bluetooth was on, so I turned my Bluetooth off. Uh, let me know what you guys think of the sound on this one now. And I noticed that uh, in the last video that I did, it wasn't really static or anything in that video, but I did notice like after I finished recording and I started using it a little bit more, I did start to hear static. Now, again, this could be because of frequency. So I'm really curious to know what it sounds like now, if it's still static or not, or maybe I need to clean out the headphone jack. I don't know. I did notice though that it was staticky with the headset microphone. Other than that though, it did sound good. It was very loud actually, um, way louder than the road. Obviously the microphone is closer to me. This is about as low as I can talk right now. So, I mean, I can go a little bit lower, but right now this is normal tone voice. I'll talk a little bit lower now. So let me know what you guys think. Does it sound good? Uh, I don't want to yell too loud, but this is a little bit louder. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below right now. I'm gonna switch over to my Rode Video Micro microphone now. We're gonna compare the headset microphone with the lapel lavalier microphone that you're hearing now. Okay guys, so we're back to the Rode Video Micro microphone. 
uh, as you all see here, this one was 50 bucks. So you can get this on Amazon. I'll leave it in the link in the description as well. But I personally think those ones sound awesome. And as soon as I turned the Bluetooth off, I did notice that the lavalier microphone was working perfectly fine. I didn't hear any problems with it and it sounded really good. It was kind of, it had a really nice type of podcast, a little bit of muffle, but I kind of liked that sound. It was really nice to hear my voice with a little more bass in it than you're hearing now. Obviously, this is a really clear, uh, you can hear my voice pretty well with this one, but it's not as loud, I'd say. You don't have as much a decibel range because the microphone is further away from me. Now, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna use these splitter cables. One side, I'm gonna use the lapel microphone, and then the other side, I'm gonna use the headset microphone. So we're gonna test these two, see how they sound. I'm gonna use the extension cable that comes in the box, of course, and uh, we're gonna see what happens next. Okay, guys, so this is the test to see if it's actually gonna work. Now, one thing I wanna point out is that I did just notice that nothing popped up on my smartphone saying that it was recording the audio. So that means it could be just recording audio from my cell phone, which means that it, the cables do not work. Uh, that means the splitter cable doesn't work uh, with these two. Now, I don't know if that's the case for it, but we're gonna go ahead and see and test this one out. This is the lab microphone I'm rubbing now, and this one, we'll rub that. Let me know what you guys think. So this is the lab right here. I'll bring it a little bit closer, in fact, We'll take this one away and I'll bring this lab microphone a little bit closer. Then I'll take this lab microphone away and put the headset closer. Let me know what you guys think. If there's any difference, uh, we will see. And I'm going to add this part in the video because I didn't do anything besides plug it right into my phone. Hey guys, we are using the headset microphone now. Uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think. I'll go ahead and put this headset one away really quick. Okay, so I have the headset microphone at a distance now, and I'm now bringing the lavalier microphone close to me. So apparently it looks like it's working with the uh, with my computer, but it does not work with your cell phone. So keep in mind that you're going to probably be in more of a podcast format anyways when you're using this. So overall, though, I do think they sound both very good. Uh, literally $20, guys. I mean, that Rode microphone was $50 and it doesn't even sound near as good as this. Besides the fact that it's clear, I will say I do like the bass in this, but uh, this is a sample from Audacity. I haven't changed anything, nothing has changed. Uh, everything's set to normal. Everything's at its normal settings right now. So let me know what you guys think. I'll talk to you guys in just a little bit. Alrighty guys, so we're using the headset microphone again. As you all saw from the test, turns out that they do work they just don't work with my smartphone. So that's a bummer that I didn't work with the smartphone, which is fine though. I think maybe I can find another splitter cable or something. I will say my only con about all this is that there is a lot of wires and everywhere going on right now. As you see here, they do have a strap for you. You're able to do a little bit of cable management because of that. But I will say it's just a lot of stuff going on right now with the wires like the headset and then you have the lab microphone over here that's where you want to kind of go wireless now i'm wondering maybe they'll let me use uh maybe the wireless set in the future maybe i could try one of those ones out because that's where i really want to get to is that wireless point i really want to go wireless like i'm trying to go wireless but i do like the fact that i am wired in so there's no like lag latency with the audio overall though i just want to retry the headset microphone with the bluetooth off and see how it sounds now if it's still staticky or not let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Overall though, I will say, I think this is the best bang for your buck. This is literally under $20, guys, $20, and you get the headset microphone, you get an extension cable, you get a splitter cable, you also get a lapel microphone. It's really hard to complain when the price is that low. I mean, I could understand if it was like $50 or something, but $20, guys, this is a solid set for a beginner, and if you're looking for something to just kind of enter that audio field and whatnot, I think this is a great product, and I definitely Definitely give it a thumbs up for me. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Remember to subscribe to the channel for more content like this. And they will post notifications to stay up to date with everything that's happening on the channel. Thank you again, Fifine, for reaching out to me to review this product and for sending me a newer pair so that I could use the headset microphone. That's all for today's video. Thank you all for watching once again. And until next time, you guys, peace out.